Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Yumi from Yumi the Book Demon, and today we are doing Demonathon. We are announcing Demonathon Grand Hotel officially. I am still very nervous about everything that is happening, but the website's up and I can't, will not touch it anymore. If you are unfamiliar with Demonathon, you didn't participate in the first Demonathon in February, here's what it is. You are a new summoner. You have met a demon. They kind of want to make a contract with you, so they whisk you away to this fabulous hotel. In exchange for some time and maybe some adventures, they will grant you a wish of your choice. The first thing you have to do is go to the website and explore the hotel a little bit. Once you get to the hotel, you will be asked to present an invitation. If you are new, you've never done Demonathon before, your demon can have the invitation for you. If you've already completed Demonathon back in February, your invitation was given to you then when you completed everything. If you still have the email and still need to go back to find the invitation, um, their password is on there, you should still be able to access it. Once you present this invitation, you will meet this grumpy looking demon. He will ask you to sign in, which is going to be your formal entry into Demonathon. Once you've signed this, depending on what route you are taking, you will be able to summon your demon and attempt a contract. What this means is that even though you have summoned this demon and would like to attempt a contract to gain your wish, they still need proof of your dedication to their end of the contract, which is to make memories and to have lots of adventures. In order for you to prove your dedication, you are required to read, and this will be a month long of reading books and having adventures and enjoying the hotel for what it has to offer. And you will be given a password to your first hotel room. Now these hotel rooms are a bunch of different parties. There are six parties total. You will be required to put in the password in order to gain access to the room. Each party is hosted by a particular demon and each room is themed. You will meet someone, at least one demon in there, who will give you a password in order to get to the next room. You will also find all the prompts in each one of these rooms. Six rooms, six prompts. I highly suggest keeping a spare piece of paper nearby to write down all of your passwords or to keep a note on your phone somewhere. You will definitely be able to find these passwords again but it's probably best if you just have your cheat sheet as it were. Every room will have a prompt. Every room will have a password to the next room until you've reached the end. You will also find your helper demons. There are four helper demons that you will find and then a fifth one which is your demon who really wants you to win this contract. So please take advantage of the demons as you will. You don't need to use your, any of the helper demons if you don't want to, but if you find it too difficult to complete your tasks, they are there to help you complete your contract. You don't have to stay in any of one of these parties for too long. These rooms are going to be open for as long as Demonathon is running. In order to complete these prompts, you may use as many or as few books as you deem necessary or that you feel that you want to attempt. However, there is a secret number of points that you must complete in order to win your contract. It isn't that hard, I promise, but we do want to keep you a little bit on edge just to make sure that you are dedicating to your demon. And also, if you are doing another readathon during the month of September, uh, you are totally allowed to use those books as well if they fit the prompt. I don't want to make this any harder than it already is. Time is a little tough and I don't want to pressure anyone into doing anything that they don't want to. However, if you want to do hard mode, which is attached to the giveaway, every prompt must have its own book. So six prompts, six books. The giveaway will go to the person with the highest number of points and it will be one book off of your Amazon wishlist just because it's a lot easier for me to send books via wishlist as opposed to the book depository. So please have your Amazon wishlist available if you are entering the competition. Again, you don't have to. Unless you are summoning a second demon because that is hard mode, you don't have to enter the giveaway at all. You also must complete all of the challenges, which again are not hard, but you must do them. These challenges are not gonna be necessarily announced on Twitter, YouTube, or Instagram. Most of them are already on the website, so you need to explore the hotel, 
a little bit more. Do take a look at every nook and cranny that you can. They're obvious, but not necessarily in places that you would naturally go to i.e. in the rooms. And please don't forget to tag hashtag demonathon or and or at demonathon depending on where you want to post these. I do want to make sure that I am promoting as many of you as possible so please at demonathon I will get them. How you will keep track of points is via this spreadsheet um, and I will insert at the end how to copy this spreadsheet on Google Sheets so that you don't have to worry about it. The number of points and everything is tracked for you so don't worry about any of the math but uh, you do need to keep track if you are summoning a demon or summoning a second demon. If you are not summoning a demon, if you already have one, if you had completed your contract back in February, um, congratulations, this is gonna be like easy pie for you. You don't have to keep track of your points if you don't want to. There are no points, you just do you. Have fun in all these rooms and with all these parties and have a great time with your demon. For everyone else, this is a requirement, so please go check out the website. There is a full listing of instructions depending on what path you need to take at the information desk. Demonathon begins September 1st and ends September 30th. On the 1st of October, you will be allowed to submit your final numbers, your final spreadsheet, and find out on October 2nd whether or not you have won your contract or not. Please do submit your final spreadsheets at the end of the readathon, even if you don't think that you have won. You may have won your contract, you don't know, because it's a secret number of points. There is also a final ending. There is one more room for you to go to in order to finish out the readathon, which will be available October 2nd. Please go do this. It broke my heart a little bit last time because not everyone submitted their final count and I was unable to give you the ending to the readathon. And the ending to this readathon will push you into the next one that will be in February. So it is really important that you submit your final counts. I Even if you really do think that you failed, you may, you probably haven't, honestly. Now the only task that I will give you right now is to go to the website, which I will link down below. The website will be on Twitter and Instagram as well. I don't wanna spoil anything here because I, I've put in a lot of time and effort to make each one of these rooms and give you a little bit of a story to go along with it. Finally, I want you to remember that we do have a group read. It's gonna be a short story called Dead Air. It is free online. Um, the links are in the at the information desk, but also down below. It's an interesting short story, a um, little bit differently formatted than what we're used to, but still honestly creepy. And I I really hope that uh, you you enjoy it. I, I think you will. All right, so if you don't know how to make a copy on Google Sheets, this is how you do it. Um, you'll get a link to the Grand Hotel worksheet and you'll see that it is up here in the corner. Um, we're gonna go to File, Make a Copy, and you'll be able to make a copy of this. Um, put your name, it would really help me just keep track of everyone, um, and it also distinguishes in your Google Sheets home, whether it's your sheet or the regular Grand Hotel sheet. So I'm gonna say okay, and eventually with my slow ass internet, you'll see that this is the copy of the Grand Hotel worksheet. Um, let's put this to 90 so that you can see the whole thing. Um, and this is kind of how this is all gonna work. So let's say that I have a song below water, which is 288. I completed this book and this is a POC author. And you can see that every time I click one of these check marks that it adds more points automatically. You don't have to, to worry about that. Um, and let's just say for, you know, argument's sake that I did this twice. So I also used a song below water for the ivory room. 288 will not go right here because I only read the book once. I don't want to add more points, but I did complete it and it is again a POC author. So that's 15 points right there. You can see I already have a total of 318. Again, just for argument's sake, so you don't have to worry about where your points are, or what's going on. Um, let's say I read three more books than what I needed to. This is already 30 points. I'm at 348 total. Everything that you check will have a value. You can see everything has a value um, and it automatically totals this for you so you don't need to worry about that. When you go back into your Google Sheets home, 
you'll see that you'll probably have still access to the Grand Hotel worksheet. Again, please do not use this one. Use the one with your name on it that you made a copy of. It will keep all of your points. Um, if anyone does accidentally use the regular Grand Hotel worksheet, I will be deleting it. So please, again, please, please, please just make a copy. It's very simple and it's automatically saved for you. Whenever you turn in your sheet at the end, because it's all Google Forms, you'll be able to just automatically upload it. You don't have to download this onto your computer or your phone or anything. Um, it, it's pretty simple, but I just wanna make sure that you all know how this works. I had to relearn how this works last time, so I really apologize for all the confusion from last demonathon. That is everything, so I hope you have a great time and this all made sense, and if you have any questions, please feel free to contact so, me. I believe that is everything. Um, thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell down below if you haven't already for content that will be hopefully a lot better than this. I really hope that you participate in demonathon. It, this has been a lot of work, and I really hope that you enjoy this little romp into an imaginary hotel somewhere. Thank you so much, and I will see you soon. All right, bye. She said it will never go away. I know there is nothing left to say. Can we try to hold on just for now? Even if we don't know how to show them what we're all about. Oh, oh, oh.